Hello. Hmm, why did that do that? There we go. Huh, interesting. I see Lube Helios as first. Tic Tac, the Raging Asian. Nish. Nishki Renat. Nishki Enrai. Hello, the panda. Too busy eating that goat. No, I did not have Hoja. Millie Birdie, Boy underscore Pie. Stain Frosty, Corbin Dallas. I'm on actual Fiji. Actually Fiji. Hello, hello. How is everyone doing? Um, long it takes for the bot to ping my server oh that is loud staying frosty thank you so much for the twitch prime sub kiss my homies gian hello bot gonna be omega late do you recommend the hskb pro for gaming uh yes i think topra is perfectly fine for gaming I used to game on Topra for a while. <laughs> T-shirt edition. Yeah, it's a little, it's a bit hot today. It's a little hot to wear a hoodie. Hey, Tia, I've been a YouTube viewer for quite a while now. First time, first stream I've joined on just to see the magic in action. Oof, hello, Stain Frosty, hello. Comrade seventy one, thank you so much for the follow. What do you think about the GK sixty one? Let me refresh my mind on that. Uh, I have not played around with the GK sixty one. It's hot swap, it's Type C. Fifty bucks. It's a pretty good deal, I'd say. Comrade, thank you so much for the Twitch Prime sub. What's your opinion on the new mint yawk pandas? Um, not much. I mean, they're the same as just the regular yawk pandas. And you guys should know my thoughts on the yawk pandas already. It's, it's just a recolored yawk panda. Are you going to Keycon? I don't think I can. Don't think I can go to KeyCon. <sighs> Would have liked to go though. The customers that buys commissions from you, are they type typists or gamers typically? Uh I don't know. <laughs> I don't ask what purpose the keyboard is for. Um I would say no one really I would say most of them are typists at least. I don't know if they're a gamer, but Do I make ortholinear boards? Uh, I can. I've just never been requested to build one. Um, I mean, the customer sources the parts. So as long as you send me the parts, I can build it for you. Ah, oh, I forgot to tweet. Shoot me a DM on Twitter before you go to bed tonight. So I can give you a smooch. Okay, kiss my homies, GN. Oh wow, Mr. Zombamon <laughs> tweeted at me, you are late. <laughs> uh, 
building a singer right now. Come join me at HTTPS Twitch Tehot Types. Did I spell that twitch.tv? Oh, I did spell it wrong. Teha Types. There we go. I also need to edit the command. Supposedly. <laughs> Boy underscore pie, thank you so much for the two months in a row. <laughs> Have some of my student loans. I, I'm trying to pay off student loans right now. Feels bad. Got, got quite a while. Uh, chat commands. Discord. I need to remove the exclamation point. Does that also break the other stuff then? What about YouTube? Mm. Uh, okay, Teha, I'm continuing my subscription. Thank you, Mr. Zambamon. Do you personally like the feel, sound of aluminum or polycarbonate cases for linear switches? Specifically Telios V2. I have never built Telios V2 in a scientifically controlled environment of aluminum and polycarbonate cases for it. Um, I, I like both, it's different. <laughs> I, I wouldn't say one's better than the other, it's hit him with that preference. Chip Noodle, hello, Rooster TM, Will, hello. Ooh, we have Lark Carps. Lark Carps, were you here all weekend? Have you, did you, were you here Friday or Saturday? Uh, wood case or CNC aluminum. What do you mean by that, Tim? Are you asking me which one I prefer? Discord just got pinged. Okay, nice. Glad to, glad to hear my Discord. We got pinged. Quantric, I am so proud of you. What? What are you? Why are you proud of me, Quantric? Thank you. Thank you for the kind words, though. Oh, wait, what happened? Look at this, Lark Carps. Look at this. Look at this. Wait. Boom. We have a second camp upping that production value. Anyone know when the Leaf 60 is dropped? Wait, what? Didn't the Leaf 60 already conclude group by a long time ago? Yeah, Leaf 60 ran already. I don't know. Are you talking about delivering? I don't know when that's delivering. Oh, you already saw that. Not impressed. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, Marcy. Oh, you're just stopping by. <laughs> Thanks for stopping by, man. Yeah, Leaf 60 ended a while ago. Where did you get that cherry blueprint? Uh, this was ran on Geekhack last year. I joined a group buy for it. You can probably find it somewhere on Taobao, I'm sure. It's, I mean, there's tons of cherry spec mat, spec desk mats, so you can probably Google it. <laughs> what soldering kit do I use? Uh, you can do command gear find out what tools I use. Shinobu SW. Shinobu Southwest. Thank you so much for the follow. Our QMK Nautilus. Worth paying 200 bucks on. 
Wait, the Ration Asian, why'd you gift it a sub? Now I can't give it a lifetime sub. <laughs> no, feels bad. I just submitted a Twitch partner request so I could give it a lifetime sub, but now it's gonna get rejected again because it just got gifted a sub. <laughs> Thank you for gifting the bot a sub though. <laughs> the Raisin Asian. <laughs> Freaking Ray. No, no, now, now the Twitch support team is going to think I'm smooth brain. I sent them an email. Oh, the, the subscription on my bot has finally expired. Could I give it, could I get lifetime subscription on it? They're going to be like, hmm, it still has a sub. <laughs> I'm gonna lose Twitch partnership because of Rage and Asian. Um, there aren't too many nice wood cases out there. I I would I still prefer aluminum in my opinion. I don't think there's ever been like a wood case that's wowed the community yet. Hey Kuroi. <laughs> headphones, I have a headphone command, CV, it's the mass drop. I don't want to butcher it. Soul always checking in from San Diego. Hello. What kind of toothpaste do you use? Um, I like Sensodyne, Sensodyne, Sensodyne. Um, but my go to is Glister. I think every Korean grew up with Glister. tried lube space invaders I have not do you only build 60% no I did not I don't think I built a 60% this weekend so then we're all my sensitivity what the heck is this math problem Um, FVXI, thank you so much for the follow. Cartoon Fartoon, thank you so much for the follow as well. This. Ooh. X Flues, thank you so much for the follow as well. Our thumbs are going to die again today, guys. Extra crispy, thank you so much for the Twitch Prime sub. Because we are going to build yet another Singa with Holy Pandas. I think this is like Holy Panda X Singa build number six or something. But today's Singa is different. It's aluminum. New lube switches once they are soldered on the PCB. Is it possible to open them up from the top? Only if the plate supports switch top removal. It's pronounced aluminium. Is it really aluminium? I'm American, I don't say aluminium. Oh, look at how shiny this is. You can see the plate on the... But we have a red aluminum, red aluminium plate. No brass. 
I don't think I've actually built a Singa with an aluminum plate. Like, I think all the Singas I've built had a brass plate. Oh, but look at this red. Oh, you can see my overhead cam right there. This is a beautiful shade of red. Yeah, Singa or Cat Wee Wee does a lot of good work. <laughs> this, these are my fingerprints. It's not Anno imperfections. <sighs> Cat, Wee Wee is, Cat Wee Wee is such a good username. Yeah, it is. Oh, there you go. Has anyone ever seen a white weight? That white weight. Wow, this is really polished. You can see the the C stand camera just hanging above my head. Let's see how much this weighs. Room tour off of single weight, please. <laughs> I'll give you a sneak peek of the room tour. Oh, there's my closet. Can you pick out the Mr. Sleeves hoodie right there? Oh, that's it. If we hit, if we ever hit 1k subs, I'll do a room tour. <sighs> 1k subs, a room tour. This board, unbuilt, weighs 3 pounds, 10.3 ounces, or 1,655, 54 grams, without the plate. This is, this is beautiful though. Uh, Amir, thank you so much for the follow. Oof, a red foam for a red case. Let's take it apart. Wait, what the? Well, that, that was dangerous. Show me the sand? I don't know if I can reflect the sand. No, I can't show you the sand. The sand is like, it's on the stand. Yeah. This was only screwed on in two corners. Foey, thank you so much for the follow. Salt Snake Drive, hello.
red is phenomenal. This is a very big nut kind of red. This is a nut worthy red. TBH IMO. All right. Let us get to the PCB. Oh, this also comes fully sealed. Interesting. Why is it the Alliance Lion but Horde colors? This is genetics. I'm not sure. Are there are the differences between the Zelios V2 large? Uh, what differences with Zelios V2 and what? Zelios V2s between each other. Um, not super large, it's, a, it's mostly a weight difference. So we have seen the PC, not the, the, the PCB for the Singa before multiple times on my stream, so no need to go through it. Uh, this customer did not get the RGB kit because, well, it's it's aluminum. You won't see the underglow, so there's no point in installing it. Okay. Have you built a profile, a board with Cherry MX Cherry Low profiles yet? Nope. It's low Pro isn't really popular. In the uh, enthusiast community, <laughs> I don't have enough to spend 1k on a keyboard. The switch are important. I thought about Zelios V2 purple and rubber keycaps from Matrix, and I want your opinion about the glorious GMMK compact since you can buy without switch and keycap. Uh, I think the GMMK is a pretty good. Uh, entry level keyboard. Um, it does have hot swap, which means you can try out a lot of cool switches without having to solder, desolder. So I think it's, I think it's a good starting point for someone like you who is starting off in the community, and it is decently affordable too. Yeah, I would, I would recommend the GMMK. No, I don't want school. Does it matter what type of conductor you use for the PCB? Um, no, you could honestly use paper clips. You can use old diode pins. It's just tweezers tend to be easy because you can control how you can spread it apart as wide as you want or keep it as tight as you want. As long as it can conduct, that is all that matters. What do you think about Alps switches? I like Alps. I am a big fan of Alps. I am hoarding a lot of Alps. I'm just waiting for the perfect board to put them on. Um, if you watch my YouTube videos, I have quite a bit of videos on Alps as well. I, 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 haven't, I have a playlist dedicated just to Alps typing tests because I like Alps that much. I believe we are going stepped caps lock today. Oh, enter. Shift.
think this is FN. Keys trigger on this. I've never personally had issues with Singa PCB so far. Are Duck PCBs bad? I've heard bad things about them. I have never had an issue with Duck PCBs. I have had quite a bit. Um, the only complaints I've heard about Duck PCBs were they don't they might not last as like they're not durable in terms of rebuilds. So you might not want to rebuild them too often, but. I've never had a duck PCB just like die on me or anything of that sort. What do you think about Gator on yellows? Gator on yellows are pretty good switches. Um, and a lot of people like the springs in Gator on yellows. Some people will just take the springs and put it into a nicer switch. Uh, I want the bottom step caps. But no split backspace. Okay, we're going full backspace stepped cap. IMO the best budget switches. Yeah, Gator on Yellow, definitely a great budget switch. Headphones when listening to music, they are pretty fantastic. I'm not really a bass head, I listen to a lot of acoustic uh, or jazz music, so I don't really, I don't really want nor look for a lot of bass. And I, I have been liking these headphones so far, but I'm, I'm not like an audio expert or anything. So we're doing four stabs today. What well, capture card do you use? Would you recommend? I'm thinking about stepping up my streaming. Um, so I use the Elgato Cam Link, the Rasian Asian, but I haven't really tried any al other alternatives. Um, I know Black Magic has their own thing that's kind of popular. Yeah, but I mean, at least with Elgato, I haven't had any issues so far. If you're doing one, if you're planning on just using one Elgato cam link, I think that's okay. But like, if you want to use multiple cam links, you want to make sure you have at least two different uh, USB root hubs, or you can get their PCI cards. I think getting a PCI card solves that issue, but. How do you do with the cameras? Do they have an AC adapter? Yeah, so I have both my cameras have dummy batteries that are that hook up to a AC outlet. So it has infinite battery power now. Johnny Paul, hello. Hello, hello. Is there any panda switch that is preferred when making holy panda switches? Nope. As long as you can use a holy Jesus switch, you can use a Jesus panda, you can use a Yawk Panda, you can use a Mint Yawk Panda, you can use an OG Panda, you can use all of those, same thing. So hipster with the jar cup, you know it man. Bay Area, you gotta be hip, you gotta use mason jars for that max hipster Bay Area life. Bay Area hipster millennial life. 
Where can I buy some lube in EU? Ah, uh, that I unfortunately do not know. Don't live in the EU. I don't really pay attention to the EU all that much. Yeah, sorry about that. But Solran, one of my mods, might be able to help you out. We do have a mod to represent the EU, the EU land. Get a Le Creuset mug. I'll have to look into it. <laughs> Bay Area too strong? Yeah, Bay Area is deaf strong. When TwitchCon EU? Please! I can't even afford to fly out to KeyCon. How am I expected to go fly out to TwitchCon EU? I don't know, I would like to go to TwitchCon uh, in San Diego this year though. That sounds kind of fun. Chenny Put, you know what Bear Antler's talking about? Using a graduated cylinder. Oh, <laughs> what the heck? Is anyone from Trap planning on going to TwitchCon San Diego? Oh, Rika is planning on doing it. Uh, would you recommend your oil diffuser? Yes, I have been loving mine. But once again, my oil diffuser is one of those things. I haven't tried anything else. But I, I have zero complaints about mine. Like I've seen the one that Muji has on display. And I mean, those look nice, but they are ridiculously expensive. So I was like, as, as nice as the aesthetic is, I would rather just, it was my first one, so I'd rather just go cheap. So I went with the one I got. But yeah, no, no complaints so far. I wish I could afford a Muji lifestyle, same. I want their bean bags. Their bean bags, I think, are like one of the most worth things in their store. Their pens, I like their pens, but their bean bags. I mean, not that I have a need though. I don't, I don't ha really have guests or anything in my room. But like, if I if I ever purchase a bean bag, I think I will just save up for a Muji one. Did you see the Muji hotel? I did. Yeah, that's. That's kind of insane. <laughs> Solid snake drive, you had one? Dang. I I like seriously con contemplated getting a Muji beanbag my senior year of college. Cause like when I was in college I had friends over, but I was like, nah. It's too much money for me right now. <laughs> You can do better than Muji pens. Yo, okay, so I mean fountain pens, that's another thing I would like to get into. I have I have like decent handwriting and like calligraphy has always been something I'm interested in. But I never really did research. My friend, one of my friends, he uh he got he bought a Lambie pen. I mean I know Lambies aren't like crazy expensive or anything, but I've always heard of Lambi, but it wasn't until this week that I finally like, actually tried a Lambi pen out. It was pretty nice. I was like, ooh, ooh, this is nice. As far as I know, Lambies are like, are Lammy? Sorry, Lammy, not Lambi. <laughs> Lammies are like the budget, like budget but good go-to pen, right, within the fountain pen community I'm in the Mont Blanc yo I'm, I would like I've I felt Mont Blanc my dad has a couple Mont Blancs so those are nice but I don't think I write enough to justify owning a Mont Blanc I would rather use that money for keyboards right now but yeah Mont Blanc I would I would like to own eventually 
yeah like my dad he's been gifted a couple and they're nice I don't think they're like the ridiculously expensive Mont Blanc ones but they're nice if only I had nice handwriting <laughs> I can help you out with pen stuff if you ever want to damage your bank account, Prof McDougall says. Yeah, I'll definitely hit you up in like 10 or 20 years. <laughs> I don't think... Oh, yeah. What? Thank you for the $5 tip. Relatively new to the stream, and I love it. I love you, China's actually. Nice pen can't fix shitty hand. <laughs> like carps, you can always practice. Why is Limo connector so expensive compared to other detachable connectors? Um, I don't know. That's a good question. It, but it's just the component itself generally is more expensive might be because there's no like screwing or anything involved it just kind of latches on like I think with aviators you have to actually twist it off right I think this one just clips in I don't know I don't know too much about why the component is expensive but um, I, I do know that Limo's just whether you're buying it from a cable vendor or directly from a factory that makes limos, they're just um, they're just expensive parts in general. Limo is the inventor of the circular push-pull connectors. Limos are some military-grade stuff. Yeah. 해석 사랑해 FD Soul 여보세요 What? engineer to work on high-end medical devices, high-end audio and robots that go into space. There you go. How long are your cables? Um, so the ones I get from cable car designs, I asked them to be six feet, so I can pull it for quite a bit. <laughs> That's six feet right there. bother him to make me a cable before he leaves EU for good. Oof. Yes, yeah, Saran, hit him up. Uh, I don't know. If, if you tell him you're a mod for me, I don't know if that gets you street cred, but uh, I'm very close with Max. Maybe I can ask him to give you priority or something, but yeah. I feel like if you are also in the... Oh, you're friends with him. Okay, there you go. <laughs> Ooh, my bad, Saran. So ran with the clout. Uh, what are some good? What are some good switches? With very short travel distance. I would say probably the chalks. I felt the chalks in person; they were pretty decent. But I wouldn't really. I don't. I don't understand the point of short travel.
We're working together on a board now, but I can't leak anything else. Yo, Soren. You can tell me. PM me, man. Can I build your board? You can't tease me like that, Soren. You can't tell me you're working on a board and then not tell me about it. Your top five switches for competitive gaming, Leo Luna asks. For me personally, I don't think the switch matters. I think as long as you enjoy using the switch and it doesn't deter you from performing, I don't think the switch matters. I think it's more of a psychological thing. I think I think Jay Yoon said it perfectly when I interviewed him. Um, like I don't think the switch or the keyboard directly affects your performance in the game, but if it causes you to enjoy your experience of gaming, it might help you out. Uh, Talisman Solutions, whoa! Thank you so much for the one 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 bits. Oof! Slowly, slowly catching up to uh, Mr. James Baker Smith. Thank you, thank you. But yeah, I mean, there there are some ways that. Wait, I didn't. There should be a subs command. I can rename it. Wait, I I swear I have a subs command. Why right, carps? Oh, I don't have a keyboard. It might be sub count. <laughs> subs, sub count. S U B count. Wait, what? Wait, it was... I put it into stream elements. Hold on. <laughs> Wait a minute. Oh, there is no sub count. <laughs> huh, where does sub count... Wait, is it subs? Followers? Oh, where did it go? Sub. Well, you can. <laughs> I will. I will look into it, Lord Cards. <laughs> I use stream elements. I think mods can add commands the same way. I think. <laughs> Uh, what I miss the super the superior Rosie. Thank you so much for the Twitch Prime sub. Enjoy your new chopper emotes. <laughs> I'm sorry, Lark. I'm sorry. I'll bring it back. No, I don't use Nightbot anymore. I uh, I switched to Stream Elements. What key profile do you like best? I like Cherry or OEM. Or High Pro. Have I ever tried Yerba Mate? I have, but I've never done it like extensively. What? Is the Japanese horror writer striking again? I need to get. I should get like a uh, like a horror sound button trigger. Every time the spooky man comes by, I hit it and it plays like a spooky sound to announce his arrival. Gotta work on that. Well, so I did get a key series. I did get a. I have three switches, so I only need one and two. What? today an extra spooky stream we got a double donation from the spooky man yes yeah, so i got a try switch thank you so much japanese horror writer <laughs> a bit more inbound i don't know man i don't know if you want to provoke a spooky man but 
yeah, I have. I need one. I need one and two to switch between the scenes. Maybe I can program the third one to be like a spooky noise whenever the spooky man strikes. <laughs> Japanese horror writer, thank you so much for the the one thousand bits though, or two thousand bits today. Thank you, thank you. Your uh, your donations are going to good use, spooky man. Pudzy, hello. What lube do I use on stabs? I use Crytox 205 grade zero currently. James Baker Smith is 1000 bits away from beating Talisman Solutions for the most bits donated. Huh? Wait, Talisman is not the most bits donated. ZOPC has by far donated the most bits. I'm just dropping in, gotta get back to work, I see. Get out, be productive. Yeah, don't you have a super long paper due, Pudsy? Or was that already gone? Or is the deadline for that over? You have three! <laughs> uh, Lil Penguin Sim, thank you so much for the 10 bits. Do you know any good Discord servers for drops? What do you oh, mean, drops? Yeah. What is the sound better to type on? Aluminum or press? Whoa, I have a fat wallet. Thank you so much for the $5 donation. Uh, what sounds better to type on? Aluminum or brass? That's hard to say. I think brass tends to bring out a nice tone in a lot of switches. Like, I think Holy Pandas sound the best on brass. Uh, for linears, I have been performing aluminum a bit more lately. Um, yeah, it, it, I mean, it is preference though. Like, depending on the type of switch, I will use a specific plate. Like, for Alps clicky switches, I will... <clears throat> Thank you so much, Vintage Room, for the tier 1 sub. For Alps, clicky switches, I prefer stainless steel or aluminum. Uh, Holy Pandas, I prefer brass. Linears are the way, get linear switches, yeah. Linear switches, as of late, for MX, I have been preferring aluminum or softer materials. But yeah, I, th I think brass tends to make switches sound nicer. Mod M's, I think, sound fantastic on brass. I have a fat wallet. Thank you so much for the Twitch Prime sub. <laughs> Korean accent narrator is my favorite thing. Yeah, I like Soyeon too, my new grill. <laughs> uh, Z Zevi, thank you so much for the follow. If I don't like the color of the mint panda, should I wait for another color or should I buy them anyway? That I cannot answer. I don't know what the next color of the rerun will be for the pandas. Cannot say for certain on that. Yeah, but like my mods are saying, once you unless you build a PC or aluminum keyboard that's see-through, you won't see the switches once you put keycaps on it. So I mean, I don't think the color of the switch matters all that much. Would you like to build a Rama M68? I haven't seen you build one yet. I would. I will build any keyboard you guys ask me to, as long as with, it is within the scope of my capabilities. Uh, it's just no one has asked me to build a M60. Well, and yeah. 
I forgot I had ordered mass drop holy pandas. I joined in for that too, Zombamon. I'm waiting for those switches. There are a couple things I am waiting on. Yeah. <laughs> P. Tran, thank you so much for the follow. I feel like everyone will have too many holy pandas after. Yeah, well, I mean, you don't even, you can make your own holy pandas right now. You don't need to wait for mass drop to ship. You can buy halo clears or trues from mass drop right now. And you could buy mint yawk pandas from novel keys and make your own holy pandas. So the holy panda shortage is pretty much, the holy panda cr shortage crisis is pretty much gone now. My condolences to anyone who bought high, sold low on the Holy Panda stock. What's the main difference between the OG pandas, Yak pandas, and Jesus pandas? Not much. Someone told me here that they eat Aroki. <laughs> Yo, Talisman Solutions. <laughs> what? Thank you so much for another 1111 bits. I see the spooky man has rustled your jimmies. <laughs> um, the OG pandas, I think, are like marginally nicer. But the Yawk pan pandas are a clone of Jesus pandas. And Jesus pandas are a clone of OG pandas. But. I would say in a blind test, you can't really tell the difference. So, short answer, not much of a difference. Always wanted more than like she pretty pizza someone, might as well be you. What? <laughs> Low Penguin Sin, thank you so much for the 1000 bits. Always more than, always wanted more than like 10 free bits someone. Might as well, oof, am I your first more than 10 bit donation life penguin synth? Attack of the clones. <laughs> Mega Force, thank you so much for the eight months in a row. I think that's the first. Is that the first eight months I've seen? Mega Force, one of the OGs in this channel. Any keyboard. Oh, yikes. I can't finish that sentence, Mega Force. You almost got me. <laughs> Gandalf, hello. <laughs> Mega turn to serve. I was first, just haven't gotten on stream in a while. What lube do I use for stabilizers? I currently have been using Crytox 205 grade zero for everything, but dielectric grease works perfectly fine, like I stated in my tutorial. Huh. 
How much lube will I need to lube stabilizers and switches? Um, if you purchase one vial of lube off a place like switchmod.net, it should be more than enough for one build. Stabilizers definitely require the most lube. But yeah, two millimeters of any lube should be more than enough to complete at least one build for both stabilizers and switches. Vibzy, thank you so much for the follow. Zoran timed out Starson 3? Oh, what happened? <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna go back to work so I can get the money back I donated. <laughs> Feels bad. Thank you for the uh, donation, Life Penguin Sim. I'm on to priming now. What? How how's everyone's Sunday going? Feels bad. Tomorrow's Monday. Gotta go back to work. <laughs> When's the next mock map? <laughs> I don't know Megaforce. I uh, don't think the last one went that successfully. Don't think my chat is into mukbang. $50 buy-in? <laughs> oh, Kelly, hello! Oh, what is this straw pull? Um... Rockin' Jaw, thank you so much for the follow. Thank you so much for the Twitch Prime sub. Finally caught a stream, let's go. Oof, glad you could catch a stream. Is this your first time catching me on stream? Feels bad, but trying to find GMK muted for a month now. Oof. I thought I saw one on sale on Mech Market today or yesterday night. WLGH Disdom. 안녕하세요. What is all this straw pulling? What are you guys doing?
What would you would you use holy pandas without lube? Uh, lube Helios. I would not use any switch unlubed personally. I lube all my personal builds. Pizza OMC, you are late. Not too late. We are just about finishing up the stabs. Assuming I don't have to retune them. Dr. Kim, I'm being forced to fight all of the mods at once. What what did you do this time, Kelly? To arouse the mods like this. Yo, Sikonez, thank you so much for the two months. Would lubing MX Reds do much? Yes. Lubing MX Reds would make them feel exponentially better in my opinion. Any idea what lube to use to lose no tactility lube Helios says? Uh, losing tactility with lube is more about where you lube it than the lube itself. Um, overdoing, over lubing a switch with thick lube will obviously, over lubing in general with any lube will make you lose tactility. It's just more so how good are you with applying a moderate amount. And where do you lose? <laughs> He's grown up. Yo, Megaforce, I think I peaked at like 250 yesterday. I think my Saturday streams are the biggest. Friday and Sunday tend to be less. Code Maestro, thank you so much for the follow. Oh, Megaforce, have you seen my second cam? You haven't tuned in in a while, huh? You haven't seen my second cam, huh? Look at this. Oh, look at that. Second cam. We are we are upping the production value. You like you like that Megaforce? Your eight months of donations are going to good use. Okay, let's see where to put this 625. Hmm. Aha, uh -huh, only one location. Oh, Megaforce hasn't seen it. Oh, show him the foot pedal. <sighs> Megaforce, this is the most expensive foot pedal you have ever seen in your life. The Gasket Double O, rumored to go... Oh my gosh, I just spilled all my... The Gasket Double O is rumored to go for around $15,000 on mech market, right? And uh, so what I did, hold on, let me clean this up. I, uh, I programmed this entire left half to be F13 and this entire right half to be F14. I can just, I can just click wherever I want with my foot to switch cams. The power of QMK $15,000 foot pedal here guys no other foot pedal can claim to be gasket mount half plated uh, spacebar does not trigger anything I have spacebar set as just uh, no function because yeah But uh, I, I did buy a, a big series tri key switch to replace this. Hopefully, I'll have that up next week. We need a foot pedal command. I'm gonna replace it. It's not gonna be this keyboard for a long time. By next Friday's stream, I will most likely have replaced it with the big series. Or maybe I'll build it on stream. 
because I, I will most likely lube the big series switches so you hear less of it when I'm pressing. I'm planning on putting three linear switches so it makes the least amount of noise possible. Oh, we can probably take the big series linear spring and just dunk it in here. That'd be a good clip. Lubing a big switch with a giant oversized jar of 205 grade zero. We can build it live on stream. Uh, is there a visual way to tell if an MX Black is retooled or not? Nope. Why am I a monster? Uh, what software do you use to check if the PCB is working? Uh, I test my PCBs out with switch hitter. <laughs> well, there you go. Solran successfully added it. Oh, the plate is red. Plate is red, PCB is purple. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna need my, I'm gonna need my Chinese friend Dreary today. Shantari, thank you so much for the follow. <laughs> Sakonas, thank you so much for the two months in a row. How good is your foot game with that pedal? It's pretty good, man. I don't need to aim at all. Just hit, just hit one side, and I'm guaranteed for it to work. So, so tight. Naku Taken, thank you so much for the follow. Put it in me. Typing test with foot pedal board, please. What do you mean? I can't even type with it. It literally only has F13 and F14 programmed in it right now. Thank you so much for the follow. Cypheric, thank you so much for the follow. Hmm, this corner one is...
All right, I used hyperfuse on other stuff. That's all right. Okay, let's see how this bad boy sounds. today are perfect and get to the rest Aya. is more than the brass, so it's harder for me to clip it in. GG. What if I did every other one? <sighs> I guess building four of these is still not enough to increase your thumb strength. It's time to go to sleep. Give me a good night kiss, Zamamon. No, bye, Striker. Uh, J Dub underscore RL. Thank you so much for the follow. I cannot read Japanese, but thank you so much for the follow as well. What's this? Some kind of keyboard building channel? Yes, it is. Mr. Manser Moto. We are currently building a Singa keyboard today. ASMR tea gulping, sorry. Hmm, maybe I should just... I should try this method again. Yeah, this aluminum plate isn't... solid enough. stream again. You say that is like a bad thing? I mean it's just not fun, you know, watching me put switches on. tight <sighs> hello 
슬롯야 김이츠 데 타이머 긴 유도인 유러브 이도 케이 히어 위에 고 슬럽 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 Thank you so much for the 200 bits, Dr. Kelly. <sighs> Yo, I think this is tighter than the brass plates I've built. <laughs> what is this plate? Holy moly. The finger condom is not enough for this. built a aluminum plate single with holy pandas? How did they do this? Has everyone only done brass? I feel like the brass plate is better because I don't want to bend too hard on the plate because the aluminum is going to start warping. Yeah, brass plate was easier than this. <laughs> oh, yeah. Any plate on the case recommendations from KB Defense for OJK 64 PCB? Um, any of them really. <sighs> Trim the locking edges, but then the plate is going to wiggle around, no? Switch does not want to go in anywhere. <laughs> Just be strong. <laughs> um, but regarding the KBD fans questions, is it GK64? That's a 65%, I'm guessing. I think most PCBs and plates on KBD fans, as long as you're buying it for the right form factor, it should be compatible with most of the cases. It's a 60% with arrows. Oh, 60% with arrows, yikes. Um, I would have to look at their website. The DZ60 RGB, I know, has is it 60% with arrow? So that would support it. I haven't taken a, I can't remember off the top of my head what the other layouts are. <sighs> Holy moly. actually impossible. Oh, wow, 
while we filled up the mason jar, let's see. Or a jar. <sighs> Sit on it? I don't think sitting on it is just gonna bend the plate. To any future customers out there, please, please don't ask me to build a. I will build singas, but no more holy pandas, please. Charge ten dollars extra for yacht builds. I don't even. I don't think ten dollars is worth the extra gain. Oh, that didn't go in. Put the handle of a keycap puller between the plate and PCB. This? Our keycap puller? Put the handle of a keycap puller between the plate and PCB. I think this is too tall though. Something like this? Oh, oh, is Mr. or Mrs. Ollie Burr on to some galactic brain play strats? No, it's too, mine's too thick, I think. This is tall, I think. I need to find something thinner to put. Yeah, the mine's too thick than the average. Hmm, what thinner thing can I use? I see puller the answer. I am a mister for the record. Oh, sorry. Ollie Burr. Oh, but the thing with this is I can't put it everywhere. <laughs> F. What is of similar? Hmm. streamed for one and a half hours let's go
these edge ones are like impossible to put in I feel like just kidding I like I should do the edge ones first then maybe have the most Do the sit on. I don't want to break the plate, Kelly. Droke, hello. Nice hair. I didn't get a haircut though. or the tofu case better. I like the new tofu case better, personally. Oh. External hardware, thank you so much for the Twitch Prime sub. Chingute Kuno, thank you so much for the follow. And if I missed Zonix Live, thank you so much for the Twitch Prime sub as well. Makes you stronger if you yell while pulling, putting them in. Do a battle cry. <sighs> what should my battle cry be? Cat want me to use as a battle cry. <laughs> oh, there's a there's multiple battle cries. Ah! Oh. Got a hoya moan every time. Yo, ooh, ooh yes, daddy. On yes, Io. Holy yuck. <laughs> Blackpink is a revolution. <sighs> what if my neighbor complains though? Straw pole for battle cry. Doesn't work. <laughs> Doesn't work. Oh, maybe I gotta do it upside down every single switch. week <laughs> Yee! Yee! Oh, doesn't work oh not even halfway done with this OMG I can't watch this anymore <laughs> Ghost9456, thank you so much for the Twitch Prime, sir. 
<laughs> now I'm awake. How many yeets does it take to build a singer? <sighs> oh, okay, maybe, maybe backwards is the big brain play. What did Holy Pandas link? <sighs> Looks like yeet is winning the vote. Upside down is working. Flip upside down and then you give it a yeet. <sighs> give it a Omega flow. Monka This was not going in. Happy hands. Pog you. What? Hi, Trina. Thank you so much for the host with twenty one viewers. How'd your stream go, Trina? Today's stream is a little scuffed. It's very tight. This might be the tightest plate. Monka W! Pog Champ! I'm sweating, guys. Break, break time, break time. We made good progress. <sighs> good progress. <sighs> um, for those of you guys from Trina's stream, this is the uh, billboard we're trying to build today. We got this beautiful red and polished Wait, this keyboard is called a Singa. So we're trying to build it up, but this uh, this plate is proving to be a little too tight to put switches in. <laughs> so we are yelling, we're yelling battle cries of Twitch emotes as I attempt to push it in. Uh, 
You canna see gom. Thank you so much for the follow. Bring back yeet tbh. You want more yeets? Yeet. <laughs> what is up with my chat's obsession with yeet? Uh, Spooky. Thank you so much for the follow. Oh no, the finger condom is seeing the last of its days. Rip finger condom. This finger condom lasted me six PC single builds. Yeet! It's okay, I got more. Jerry comes with a nice pack of four pairs. I still got eight or seven more left. Devil Lancey, I thank you so much for the follow. Yeet! Oh, yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much for the five dollar donation. Stratismo, thank you so much for the three months in a row. Um, do I have a playlist? You can do um, exclamation point playlist. Yeah. Yeet. Doom Trooper versus Pristine. I like both. <sighs> Lil, Lil Chop, thank you so much for the follow. Bible Thump! What? <laughs> Tic Tac, thank you so much for the 1000 bits. Holy moly. I'm glad you liked my content. I hope today's content is quality for you. I hope you have a good night and dream about all the yeets I've said on stream. Peachy Sheepy, thank you so much for the follow. Yes! Oh man, hold on. Yes, daddy! <sighs> Wait, what? what is this? Panda, please, what are you seeing? Oh, this not panda, it's rar? What the heck? <sighs> Are your housemates not home? I don't think so. I know one of them isn't. I don't know about the other one. Tic Tac just earned the 1k bits badge, nice. Yeah, Kelly, also NK Bigger Brain confirmed because he pronounced it right. What I pronounce right? <laughs> Chewy, what did I witness? Uh, Chewy, this plate, the aluminum plate is proving to be a lot harder than the brass plate. We're gonna need some battle cries to put it on. <laughs> These eats are ruining my nap. Maybe this will be the first anti-ASMR VOD from Nathan. Yeah, the plate is very tight. Um, and because it's also thin, like it's very prone to flex. So if I were to just push down, it might honestly just bend the plate. So that's why I'm, it's 
it's been taking me a bit more time than normal. <sighs> Play some new jobbies, Battle Cry. Should I play some top anime theme songs? Should I play the My Hero Academia theme song? The fight song? <laughs> no anime? Naruto song and strike? Sand and Rena Tan, thank you so much for the follow. Play something really heavy, it'll put you. I'm not a big fan of heavy. <sighs> Does anyone have the My Hero Academia hype song? You guys know what I'm talking about? Oh, <laughs> 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 Let's see, let me... Will I get flagged for this VOD if I use this song? Most likely, right? This is not the one I'm thinking about. This is not the one. Is this, is this the one? Oh yeah, it is this song.
Uh, almost. We made good progress, though. that could close a crucial sale. Your success depends on the quality of your writing. Oh You're going to want more than a simple spell check. Luckily, you've got Grammarly on your side. Oh. With just a few clicks, you can... Kage of Mech Market. <laughs> the Mecho Kage. Hey, that's pretty good. Mecho Kage. From the village of Alps. Man. I'm the founder of the village of the village of Alps. No, the song's going all the way. From Hidden Click Leaf Village. That's pretty dang. That's a pretty dang reference. Oh no, this one's popping. If you out. write anything on your computer, you need to get Grammarly. I write pretty much all day, every day, and Grammarly makes my writing better. As a student, I like that it's great. No, Actually, rip it's ads. Correcting everything as I'm writing it. Okay, so Rand sent me this. And even Writing's not right that easy, use, but so Grammarly can, can help. Oh, Gundam. This sentence is grammatically correct.
you're done. Did you feel inspired? Wait. Am I? I'm not bleeding. <laughs> what the heck? F dreary finger condom. It's red. I think it's from the red. I think it's from the pandas. Does this rub off? It's the yox thing. Yeah, my fingers aren't bleeding or anything. I'm not sure how this happened. Yeah, it's just a plastic stain. <laughs> These those are birds from the jutsu. <laughs> okay. <sighs> Gotta cool down. That was too intense. Too intense. <sighs> Two hours we haven't started soldering yet. Missing something? Why do I only have? Uh oh, I got too hyped. Where'd the bag of switches go? I only have two switches left. But I need one, two, three, four, five, six. Am I missing the bag? Hmm. <laughs> I'll have to let the customer know I wasn't sent enough switches. Yeah, I only have one panda left. Unless I was set more. But yeah, that's it. <sighs> I was not expecting to work out today. Sides of different plate at last minute. Oh gosh. Uh, Mitz one, thank you so much for the follow. My Keru, thank you so much for the follow as well. Alright, we can finally start. So entropy, thank you so much for the two months in a row. Finally get some soldering done. Joe Cole Bob, thank you so much for the seven months in a row. Ooh, Joe Cole Bob, you missed the hype anime music scenes. Made it before the end of the stream. Polly Z, you also missed the hype part of the stream. We need to solder some anchor points first. And we can get to sponsor time <clears throat> no.
No blood, no blood. It stabbed me, but no blood. Sure, switches flush. Okay. Oh man, that was too much, too much energy for me. Um, where to start? Yes. Like I showed earlier, I. If you guys are interested in nice high-end cables with Lima connectors, Cable Car Designs is the place to go to. He's currently not accepting orders, but he should be reopening in the future. And I do have a affiliate links with some of my sponsors, so please consider checking them out. It will give me a kickback in some cases, and in some cases it will also give you a discount if you use my links. I do have a link to all of my sponsors in my sponsors panel beneath my stream. But next up we have Dixie Mech. Dixie Mech is currently not running any device, but the Mecha Mats will be available soon TM. And you can also currently purchase some uh, keyboard merch or stickers from Dixie Mac. So head on over to Dixie Mac and check them out. And the next sponsor we have is KDD Fans. We talked about their T1 switches yesterday. So if you guys are curious as to how the T1s are, at least as an initial impression, you guys can uh, check out my vlog of yesterday's stream at the end of the stream. Um, the KBD 8X Mark II getting a lot of attention. I will be getting one to play around with in the not too distant future, so uh, make sure you guys tune in for that stream whenever I go to exciting stuff. Next up, we have. Kono over at Kono.store. You can currently purchase or join in for GMK 9s, GMK Lime. You can pre order the Kira Stealth or the Kira. And I would highly recommend you join in on the newsletter for the Keystone Silo switch. Uh, oh man, I missed a lot. DH Rider, Azun, Too Woke to Tote. Thank you so much for the followers. Uh, did I like the T1s? Yeah, I thought they actually pleasantly surprised me. I was not expecting much to be honest, but I don't think... Wei was not lying when he said we were going to be 
Poly Panda and Zeal Z2 clones. I, I do think I would still rather dish out the extra bit for a Holy Panda or a Xenos V2, but KBD fans, T1, seems like they'll be great for people on a budget. Yeah, and next up we have Model Keys. I do have a promo code with them, using it will get you 5% off on all your purchases. The code will switch next week, but until next Friday, it is still good to use. The code is MK space X space NK. And you can grab tons of stuff at Novel Keys right now. GMK Metropolis is currently live. The desk mats are currently live. You can pick up some mint yacht pandas. You can even get loom from Novel Keys now. So lots of stuff available on Novel Keys. Head on over and go add some stuff to your cart. Use my promo code, get 5% off on your purchases. And last but not least, we have Zeal from over at zealpc.net slash types. Zeal is a vendor who stocks a lot high-end boutique switches, be it linear or tactile or silent, Zeal has it all except for clickies. No clickies on Zeal's website. Camp Kenobi, hello! Long time no see. How you been? Frosty, hello, hello. Unless you were saying hi to Han Kenobi instead of me. That's okay. Hello! Today is it Jay or Brian that I do not know. So I know Jay was streaming earlier, so I'm guessing he's awake still. Unless it was night time for him. Oh, well, it's always Brian, my dude. Feels bad, looks like Jay just hates me. I'm sick of Brian, I want Jay. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding, Brian. Switch is best for clicking really fast. What do you mean by clicking really fast? I would say I personally like the thick clicks. I prefer those over cherry cookies. What are my thoughts on the Brutal 60 group buy? Ooh. So I've been talking to Upas quite a bit lately. Uh, I believe I will be receiving a Brutal 60 prototype to build for you guys on stream. So I can give more thoughts on that later. I know the Raging Asian and El Bibas, you guys probably know them, um, did get to build one up themselves. So you guys can probably ask them about more detailed opinions. I haven't followed the group by too closely to be honest. I mean they went live 
this week, right? Yeah, but it seems like he's trying to target a very affordable price point. I think we need more of that right now. A lot of people coming into the hobby, but not too many budget friendly options. I think it's great and perfect timing that Epos is running there right now. Any luck source? Uh, yes, Polyzoo. I will be. Res I already bought one. Uh, I bought one off of Nebulant, actually. If you met him at the NorCal meetup, Polyzoo. Yeah, he did. He already shipped it out, I believe. Ship. I should receive it before, way before next week's streams. Some exciting stuff. Only a few left on cannon keys. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, looks like Doodle 60 doing pretty well so far. Yeah, but I'm not too big of a 60s person. I'm more into larger form factors. I currently only own two 60%. The HHKB and my Gasket 00 foot pedal. What switches are these? These are Yacht Holy Pandas. More OEM. Thank you so much for the follow. Speaking of larger form factor, I read that the number 2 is going... Is it going live this week? I thought the sale announcements were going to be released. If it goes live this week, that's... That is also big news. Those, uh, those teases have been killing me. I just want to see what the board looks like already. Cult definitely knows how to tease us. I, I could be wrong, Paul Yuzu. I briefly looked, looked at it this morning on Instagram. I thought it said just sale details will be... I mean, it could mean it goes live. I don't know. Is there like a community hub for mechanical keyboard news? Yes! They call me Nox. Topclack, who is in chat, is probably the go-to news source hub for a lot of people in the community. That is what Topclack does. They cover the news every week within the keyboard community space. Topclack is, well he was, Brian was here at least, I don't know if he left. But you guys should all check out Top Clap. Um, yeah, this, despite how niche the hobby is, there's a lot of development. There, there's tons of news every week. As hard it is to believe. Um, it's David Moo. Thank you so much for the follow. Duck Souffle. Thank you so much for the 200 bits. Let's go. Hope you're having a good day. It is pretty good. A uh, pretty hype stream earlier. If you missed that, Duxy for you. Might want to catch the VOD on that. Uh, Vpez535, thank you so much for the follow. Spoiled Cream Puff, thank you so much for the Twitch Prime sub. <laughs> yeah, if a mod can shout out Top Clack. But yeah, you guys can just follow Top Clack's Twitch. We also have a YouTube. Yeah, no one, no one does news quite like Top Clan. I uh, see no, no mods today. Uh, I did miss it, but I kind of watched the vlog tonight. Nice. Yeah, 
This episode's VOD will be something special, Duck Souffle. Oh, there we go. Lark Carp's best mod. Thank you, thank you. Uh, what do you think of the Novel Key X Gatoron Glow Switches? I haven't received any Glow in the Dark Switches. So I can't really say anything about it. <laughs> Top Clock, thank you so much for the 50 bits. Who wants to see Nathan compete against other prominent community members? A keyboard game show on the upcoming. Oh gosh! Even before I lose followers, I'm gonna get exposed in the game. Just to reveal how scuffed I am. <laughs> Yeah, Top, Top Clack is planning on doing a 24 hour stream. I don't, I don't think I'll do a 24 hour stream of my own for a long time, Brian. <laughs> Have you been commissioned to do any work with Magic Force boards? I love the four factor and layout. Uh, no, no one has asked me to do anything to a Magic Force. A Magic Force, sorry. Bent on this one. Is GMK nines worth in your opinion? Uh, how much is it? I actually don't know the price of it. I think the colorway is pretty nice. Can't go wrong with the colorway, I think. I think the colorway of GMK nines is pretty nice. I would. <sighs> if I was in need of a GMK set, nines would be one of the ones I consider. fell asleep what I miss <laughs> Croy did you miss oh no you watched the anime theme songs though right or did you miss that too you were listening to some anime theme songs Croy that's where he turned off the stream and died inside dang Any suggestions on keycaps for my PC Salamander? Uh, Hyperfuse is generally popular with polycarbonates. Yeah, I mean, there's tons of keycaps that you can put on polycarbonates. Any any keycap set that's like white based would look really nice on polycarbonate too.
Okay. Leave. I soldered. Oh, I have one left. I can deal with that later. Star 247, thank you so much for the tier one sub. sent enough switches apparently. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Yeah, I was only sent 80 switches, but I need more than 80 switches. Yes, yeah, so I'll send 80. One, two, three. I need. At least for this configuration, I need three more switches. Feels bad. Yeah, you pretty much need as much as a TKL for this layout. A wind keyless TKL. I'm just using this to uh, test for straightness. We can decide on keycaps afterwards. This is GMK Pristine. Let's see. Oh, yikes. Left shift definitely needs some straightening. soldered on the cap slot yet. All the switches look crooked. And it might be possible. Cap slot still crooked.
Okay, caps lock, now street. Oh gosh, look at this pipe key. It is not what you want when you solder. <laughs> That's because this plate is universal. straightened. <laughs> Top Cloud, thank you so much. For three months, you get the new sub badge. For gifting five subs, Twazi Youngje, Tito, Tai Tofu eight five nine one two Slutherino, Peripheral Installer. Enjoy your emotes. Whoa! Thank you, Contacts. Thank you, thank you. Okay. Board is now straight. Let us test how we did.
This is my favorite part of the build, where NK eventually picks up the keyboard, cocks it to his ear at a slight angle, and appears to, to burp. Wait, what? <laughs> Isn't that when I'm testing for stabilizer talisman solutions? Sounds pretty good without the keycaps. But yes, everything works with the switches I have been given. We are short on switches in today's build, so I will let the customer know that I did the best I could. The number of switches I had. Did you test fit the plate in the case? I did not. Uh, I haven't had any issues with that on singles. who keeps the sucker in the original packaging does everyone else do that to you i don't know I'm, I'm so trained to like keeping original packaging because i don't know a lot of the stuff i like buy or yeah, a lot of the stuff for other hobbies that I'm in, having the original package tends to up the resale value, so... You still have yours in the packaging too. I let mine re rest in a little pot of vinegar, what the heck? That's Sprite? No, I wish. It is a Perrier. I'm on that keto life, so no sugars. Okay, let us screw it. Into the top piece. Sub badge? Oh, it's there, top clerk. It's 2.5. Give us the nipple lion? Oh no. <laughs> Not like this. Teal, cool. Thank you so much for the follow. Let it loose a little bit. Leave it a little bit loose. Max winning, thank you so much for the follow. This red is V nice. It's a very like deep and dark, it's almost like Depending on the lighting, it's like borderline burgundy or maroon, which I like. How often do you rotate keycaps, key sets for different feels? Um, so keyboards, I will rotate generally two, every two weeks. Generally, it's not a hard set thing, but keycaps, I don't really rotate. Once I build something, and put a keycap set on it, I won't really change it out. Yeah, like when I when I try to build keyboards, I try to theme it with the keycap in mind. So I, uh, once I intentionally put keycaps on my boards for the aesthetic or use case of it. Kicker is live. Ooh, we haven't given Kicker a raid in a while. 
can give Kicker a raid. It's been quite a long time. Do you mix switches on your personal keyboards? I, what do you mean, like within the same build? No, I did not. Have roommates home, or housemates home. I also realized the customer did not send me bump bonds. I wonder if they'd received it without bump bonds. Air resolution illusion. Thank you so much for the follow. James Baker Smith. Hello. That's lit. Yeah, this is pretty lit. This red is honestly so nice. Oh, this song. Oh. Let me change the song for you. Oh, Beast Troll's also alive. Ooh, that's a tough call then. Yeah, this red is honestly so nice. trackball mouse as your daily driver yes I use it at home and also at work what James Baker Smith thank you so much for a hundred bits appreciate it what was my first ever mechanical keyboard uh, if you mean a nice mechanical keyboard what got me hooked into the hobby was the Topra 104 High Pro. Real 4, sorry. That was the first nice keyboard I bought. Look at this color coordination. Are you into cars? Not, kind of, not really. I do appreciate good cars. Cars, I'll probably never own a nice car. Um, when I did photography, I used to be into, uh, I used to do automotive photography for a little bit. Can't even afford the bus. Dude, buses in the Bay Area? Not cheap. <laughs> okay, what keycap sets to put on this, guys? What keycap sets? No blockers? Yes, this is the win key version, but we were not sent enough switches. <laughs> so I sacrificed the bottom row. I own a Miata and I'm into cars. Nice, not equal to into cars. That's true. I'm not really into cars then. I appreciate nice cars. I don't care too much for modding myself. I'd much rather pay someone, assuming I had the money, but yeah. Do I even bust out keycaps or is there a unanimous agreement today on what to use? Black on white. Uh, still shots, not ASL. Not I. I wish I did races, but yeah, I've never I've never been to like a track and taken photos there. But mostly just like stills. Guess there's no uh, unanimous agreement, so I'll bust out my sets. Is the straw poll mod ready? So we have muted. I don't own Red Sam, unfortunately. GMK muted. GMK 9009. We have white on black. 
You can stick with Pristine. And then we have Terminal Olivia Camping. And also JTK Yolch. Those are the options. Any straw poles available. Man, even the panda is slacking. Oh, I can't alt tab on this. F. I can still control C though. Control V. Okay. Kuroi has posted one, guys. Go vote. Go vote. Everyone go vote. Dean is actually winning. <laughs> see some, uh, see some hate on camping. Yo, I think it's a clear, pristine win today. What's a good set with a black case? Yeah, black is pretty neutral and uh, easy to put a case on, or keycaps on. Many mods we can put because of this bottom row, but <laughs> no mods, just pure white. Just pure white. Is that the big brain play? I am level. Thank you so much for the Twitch Prime sub. Did I also miss X Riyadh? Sorry if I missed you. Thank you so much for the follow. Whoa. Whoa. -oh. What mouse is that? I have a mouse command. You guys want the overhead cam instead? You guys like this better for putting keycaps on? Oh, what happened to my mouse command? Oh, there you go. It's already got used, that's why. The tally cam. <laughs> Is there a difference between pristine and minimal? I believe they are different shades of white, right? Yeah, I, I think they're different shades of white. Don't rem I don't know the exact difference off the top of my head, but there are different shades of whites out there.
that looks pristine. Should have been paused there. Does that look good? Uh, one page of keycap, but two. Maybe you should you should try to get some big Fortnite players into custom keyboards. Um, I mean, if, <laughs> if any Fortnite player wanted to get a custom keyboard, I would love to build them one, but the Entering Pro Gamers is kind of hard. Like, when, because of their sponsorships, they have to use certain keyboards. Um, so there's like almost no reason for them to ask me for a keyboard. Yeah, the whole like sponsoring players puts them in an awkward position as customers. I don't know. I mean, if, if you guys watch Fortnite players, and if you guys tell them, tell whoever you guys watch to check me out, that'd be helpful. But yeah, breaking into the gamer scene is kind of hard. No Fortnite players don't have keyboard restrictions only on them. No, but I'm saying even on stream, if you're sponsored by like Corsair or HyperX, I'm, I would assume one of the requirements is that they use that specific uh, company's keyboard on stream. I mean, if they would like to just get a personal keyboard to use off stream, I'd be more than happy to, but I don't think many people Many pros who aren't educated on just how much you can do with keyboards really cares. 303 or 304 for Yacht Pandas? I would say 303. I like going with a thinner lube for Holy Pandas. Corn of the smaller market player. Smaller player market, yeah. Oh, these rich. I can't alt tab. F. But anyways, um, we can pause the music as we bring out the ten fast fingers. Any 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 uh, words per minute avail as we as I set up. Oh wait, don't don't guess yet. Don't guess yet, guys. The, the mod has to start it. No, don't guess. It's not being counted, guys. Mods haven't started. Oh my. <laughs> no mods? Do we have... Oh, there you go. Now, now you guys can start putting in your guesses.
The, mo the bot will take guesses for one minute. We need more mods. Do we need more mods? Uh, I already expanded my mod team by double though. Uh, Cube Buster, thank you so much for the follow. A math teacher, thank you so much for the follow. Lewis Wolftail, thank you so much for the follow. K Swagger, 3210, thank you so much for the follow as well. Oh, okay, there we go. The bot is no longer accepting guesses. So let us see who will be in the Words Per Minute Hall of Fame. So it is currently it's one Huey away from the mic. Uh, the Dirty Doodle, thank you so much for the follow. Are you guys ready? Oh, I forgot to uh, display. Hold on. Today's build, we have a red aluminum Singa built with holy yawk holy pandas, lubed with Trebosis 3203 using Cat Wee Wee 62 gram springs. Has GMK Pristine as the keycap set. Uh, why is it missing keys on the bottom? Because the customer did not send me enough switches. <laughs> That's why the bot is missing. Yeah. If you guys ever send me builds, it would be beneficial if you made sure you sent me enough switches. Um, don't go based off the percentage. Just because you build a 60% board doesn't mean you need 60 switches. I would say take the percentage, add 10 more switches, and then send it to me. It's also possible some switches are just defunct so I might need to replace it when building so always good practice to send at least 10 extra switches when you are commissioning someone to build your keyboard yeah 40% ortho and 40 switches yeah if you guys didn't know percentage does not equate to number of keys required <sighs> okay um, th I mean this person didn't do that they sent me 80 switches but 80 still is not enough for their layout. So a little unfortunate on that end. Okay. Holy Jesus, will I get 140? Three, two, one. Oh, we do, we do, we do, we do. Oh my gosh, redo. Oh my gosh, redo. person guess 120 
120 not too bad considering how much I effed up. <sighs> Let's see how the mods sound. How the how the board sound guys, I couldn't hear it. Oops, hold on. I think I think I'll make mess up less. Can we can we get another uh, words per minute started mods? Last one, one more. <sighs> I needed a warm up. My fingers are hurting from putting it assembling this board. Oof, Gandalf the Mandalf has started it. So remember, guys, only input the number. Um, once you make a guess, there's no point in re-guessing. It'll only record your first ever guess. So yeah, once you've guessed, don't. There's no need to uh, add more numbers unless you're trying to like throw people off. But yeah, whatever you enter as your first guess is what will be counted. Jason zero one one zero. Thank you so much for the follow. Wow, boy underscore pi and polys you thinking 111. Wow, a lot of 111s. What is this? Tommy Crayons also 111. Oh, wait, I see. I see what you got it. Whoa, Sergeant R. Osu with that 1, 2, 3, 4. Oh, just kidding. You probably already guessed. I'm guessing. <laughs> All right. Guesses are over. How well will I type this time? I don't know, the other two singles I've built, I hit 130 plus 140 with them, but this one, this one is not that. What? Yeet! Talisman Solutions, thank you so much for another 1111 bits. That's three Talisman Solutions classics in a stream. That's a, that's a big treat. You are very close to James Baker Smith. Oof. Does James Baker Smith lose his spot as the monthly top cheer? Wait. The monthly top cheer for Twitch and stream elements is different. Hmm. Can't gift 111111 anymore. Well, he can gift. He can gift. One 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 one. <laughs> okay, let's go. Three, two, one. Oh, redo, 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 redo. Whoa, whoa, whoa! What is this? What? You can generate screen. Oh, redo, redo, redo. Three, two, one. Oh, redo, redo.
No! 127. Ooh, we had a couple 127s. What the heck? Congrats to Xylix, Zorags, Other, Rocket Man, Sniff 47. <laughs> yeah, a lot, a lot of winners. Yo, peripheral installer, thank you so much for continuing the gift you got from Contacts S2. Appreciate it. Yeah, look at this beauty. Let me let me give you a, a sound difference. How about that? Oh, I packed up the Helios. But this is so it's one Huey away. So this is a Topra unlubed but silenced with silenced X rings. This is Holy Panda's lubed. These are just, the gray and white is just stock HHKB blink keycaps. This is a third party pink Topra spacebar, all PDT. And then these two are artisan keycaps from Brocaps. Yeah, but that's the, uh, the sound difference. Holy pandas are significantly louder. Uh, just tuning in, are the empty switch slots going to fill not sure, it depends on what the customer wants to do. They didn't send me enough switches, that's why they are empty. It's not because, yeah, that's the only reason why they're empty. So we'll see what they want me to do. If they want to mail me more switches so I can build it or I just ship it to them like this and then they complete the build, but yeah. Uh, any, any other sounds for comparison? How's the spring weight? Uh, it feels pretty nice. Maybe I was wrong about 62 gram not being able to return. This is supposedly using a 62 gram cat wee wee spring and it's having no issues returning. I tried to tier three sub, but someone gifted me a tier one so I won't let, ooh, feels bad peripheral. Ne next month though, next month. <laughs> you guys want a typing test of the silence X-rings? do that. This is a Topra Pro one. Does not have it's not lubed, but it is silenced with silence X rings. We won't we won't make a we won't make guesses for this. I'll just let you guys hear it. Alright. Oh we do we do. Oh we do we do. Redo, redo, redo. Oh my gosh. I'm tilted. <laughs> what?
take CD. What talisman solutions? Thank you so much for the one 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 two bits. Oh, you have overtaken uh, James Baker Smith. You are the monthly top cheer. Wow. Wow. How did how did the toper sound, guys? It's unlooped, by the way. If I lube it, it'll probably sound way better, but. I plan on keeping this stock for a while. Couldn't resist that 50k badge. Are you at the 50k mark already? Hey, how close are you to beating Zeal now? I know you were somewhat close. Talisman Solutions is the number two alt. Oh god, this music. Talisman Solutions was the number two all time. Ooh, still a good ways off from Zeal though. Zeal is still 20k ahead of you. My HHKB is six years old. Oof, my my HHKB is 14 years old. <laughs> my my HHKB is older than some of you guys in chat. My HHKB, but there are older HHKBs. I don't know when the first year HHKB came out was. HHKB is that old? Yeah, I believe you can get it to like two. Th I, I think some HHKBs might even be pre 2000. Because the Topra Switch came out in 1984. Topra's been around since 1984. When was the first HHKB made? Uh, what does Wikipedia say? It was introduced in 1996, supposedly, according to Wikipedia. Right here. Happy Hacking Keyboard, 1996, End of Life, 2006. Happy Hacking, oh wait, I have the, oh, well there's a light in the Pro. Okay, so the Happy Hacking Pro 1 came out in 2003, discontinued in 2006, and the Pro 2 came out in March. Ah, uh, interesting. Yeah. Crazy that it hasn't changed since then. Yeah, I mean, the HHKB layout has pretty much become a classic, tried and true standard in the community, so. Uh, Asper, Aspire Action, thank you so much for the follow. Yeah, Topra, Topra is pretty old. Or it's older than you guys think. Same with Cherry. Uh, if, if you look at my sub badge thing, right? The Cherry MX Red came out in 2008, but the Cherry MX Black came out in the 1990s as well. Or 1980s as well, I think. Blue Alps was released in 1985, I think that's what my panel says. Topra came out in 1984, and the Hi-Tech 725, the Space Invaders came out in 1983. Yep, it's pretty old. Yep, MX Reds. They are the newest Cherry MX switch. Came out in 2008. Blacks came out much longer ago. <sighs> I'm sorry I failed you today, Mr. Mukbang. Sometime next week I'll try to make it for it. No problem, Panda. It's all good. Yeah, I think the MX Red came out because a lot of gamers were complaining about how heavy the blacks were. 
I know some people are like to the I think a lot of gamers like black switches or clears are like the training switch you game on blacks and clears to build like stamina and endurance and then you move on to a lighter switch when you're actually trying to perform or something but yeah that was this was the build for today's stream once again just so I can thumbnail this red single oof actually we should do the back I think the back looks sexier the red PC not PC the red Singa. Oof. Singa does beautiful work. Excited for more boards from Cat Wee Wee. I think the unicorn is starting to ship out, or I've heard news that they're gonna start shipping out soon or something. Curious as to how the unicorn turns out. Curious as to how the unicorn feels, but yeah, I, I hope Cat Wee Wee makes more stuff. Cat Wee Wee does some nice work. I'm a, I'm a huge fan of Cat Wee Wee's stuff. Okay, would you guys rather me raid someone playing Terraria or someone performing live music? Liz Vega is also live? Oh, she is live. Music, music, beast, music. I think I'm seeing more music than beast right now. Host Tifu? <laughs> we can give Kicker a raid. It's been a while since we raided Kicker. Yeah, let's do some. We had too much hype today in stream, so let's tone it down with some more relaxing and peaceful live music all right let's go kigger could use a raid today let's go cause some gentle havoc in her stream ask her about her keyboard um i think i will be streaming all next week as well um, i stopped posting my schedule on my socials. My times are set now. You can always check the uh, Streamlabs extension to see when I'll be going live. I think I'll only post on my socials whenever I won't be going live, like apart aside from my uh, normal stream. So yeah, you can assume the stream times are set unless I say so. Hope you guys all had a good time this weekend. We had some pretty nice keyboards this weekend. We'll see what we have next weekend. Uh, Alpha Light, thank you so much for the follow. Jisoo, hello! You're so late. We're about to go raid someone. <laughs> yeah. Um, there may be a giveaway coming. Shh, I don't know. But yeah, we're gonna go raid Kigger. Go cause some havoc. So until then, see ya nerds. <laughs>